So when this whole thing started, I said to Caitlin, what do you think about me seeing if Ryan would want to do this with me, like 50-50? And she said, do you think your ego could handle sharing a screen with Ryan Reynolds? Two Hollywood movie stars. Uh, I'm more of a TV star. Oh. Aw. This is not Aww. actually a bar. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, wow. TV's like way cooler than movies, you know that, right? I mean, yeah, it is. Where have you been for like the last 10 years you've been making, making movies? Yeah, making movies. I think something about Rob that a lot of people don't know is that Rob will not get off the phone until he gets what he wants. Hello, Mr. Co-Chairman. Hi, Ryan. And real sick of these draws. Yep. Yeah, it's hard to get um, it's hard to get excited about a draw. I remember he called me when I was 16, and when I got off the phone, I was in my mid-40s and owned a Welsh football club. So, you know, do not underestimate Rob. I want to say McElhenney is the name. This is kind of feeling like the draw of phone calls. Hanging up now. See you Tuesday. Love you. The positivity and the vibrancy, what Rob and Ryan have brought to the area, you can feel it. Is like a fairy tale. They've now got Wrexham under their skin in the same way as a lot of us fans. There is a real risk for us. There is a version of the story where we are villains, <laughs> where it doesn't work, and then we go, what are we gonna do? We have to sell it. And then we're the bad guys. Yeah. Fuck that. Fuck that. Yeah. It's gonna work. Your friendship actually started when Rob slid into your DMs. Do you wanna spill the tea no. on that one a little uh, bit? No, I, I slid into his DMs. Oh, you slid into his DMs. Oh my God, yeah. I mean, I, how are quickly, you kidding me? How quickly the story so changed. I know. He DM'd me back, and then we kind of became you know, digital friends, yeah. which later turned into real life human friends. We became pretty close pretty fast. Your moms don't know who Ryan Reynolds is. That, <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. He's not that well known. Between the two of us, we have something like 45 million Instagram followers and 20 million uh, Twitter followers. So we could directly engage with them. So I thought we were good. And that's Good an partners, even 50-50 no. split between the two of you, or? Uh, it's close, yeah. I've... Rob is a fuckface clown. He's just, oh, oh Jesus, oh, Rob, oh, hi, Mr. Chairman. How are you? Can we address the mustache in the room? God, you're handsome. Um, you got, right. Did you get that? You have a heel, too! Yeah, I totally, I, I, and I wore this is three, great. Inch, three inch lifts just to really, Hammer home. They, George said to establish dominance. I know, right but away. it's not it's happening. Like, no, I know, not at all. Come on. Where? Wait, when we go in here? Yeah, that's good. Now I feel like we're really close. Part of the fun isn't just getting to hang out with each other or having a football team together. It's also talking about things that can be uh, uncomfortable. We filmed our colonoscopies together, for God's sake. Look Sorry. at this. Yeah. Good Lord. I read somewhere that uh, lifting weights increases height. True. Is it better than the lens? Yeah. Not quite the Hollywood script they would have wanted. No, I think 2 0 down, 10 men, and not much more could have gone wrong for us. Well, this is how we started walking on the field. <sighs> okay. I'm all right. It's all right. <laughs> yeah. I thought you said this was going to work. Well, next year, I guess. You can't taste the sweet until you taste the sour, I guess. You're not gonna talk like this for four hours, are you? I've been waiting for the right peaceful moment to ask you, do you harbor any anger and or resentment towards me for asking you to do this? My wife wants to kill you, Rob. Yeah. 